guys, it's Sonya Miller and welcome back to my channel. You guys know here on the vlog, on the daily vlog, we love to DIY together and um, yeah, we love to travel too, right? We love to take you guys on our travels and by we, I mean me and Matt, who is sitting in the background. That is I, I am he. That is him. We ain't in Kansas, I mean Ligonier anymore. We ain't Ligonier Pennsylvania anymore. Matt has taken me on a road trip today. I had no idea where I was staying, exactly what I was even doing here, where I was coming. And it's been all unfolding. Today, I am sitting on the floor of our hotel room here in Chattanooga, Tennessee. This is what Matt calls part two, part two, of my Valentine's Day gift, yes? So, He's been keeping secrets since like February. So you ready to find out what it is? All right, what are we doing today? Congratulations, you're the brand new owner of a soccer team. The brand new owner of a soccer team? Yeah. Okay, what does that even mean? That means <laughs> you are a minority owner a in the Chattanooga Football Club, a professional men's football team. You bought into a football club? Soccer team. Soccer team? Is yes. it football or is it soccer? Hey, what other what other person what other woman's husband would buy her football club? What other husband would buy her a bunch of sweaty men in tight shorts and some with, <laughs> some with accents, right? Man, this vlog just got better. Nobody's leaving town now. Everybody's gonna stay and watch till the end. Sweaty men in short she's shorts. She's smiling right now, but short I know what she's shorts. thinking. I know what she's thinking. <laughs> I don't know a thing about Chattanooga soccer. Football Club, but it has a soccer ball. Okay, yeah. this is what I know about soccer, okay? I was a soccer mom for like a period of time when my son was four years old, I want to say. Remember, he was like four or five years old. And we were sitting in the bleachers and we're like, go buddy, go buddy! And he turns around the other way and yes. On his own goal. <laughs> on his own goal. <laughs> his, his first he was so happy. His first and only goal. It was his first. You know what else is cool about this? What is cool about this? It's not exclusive. Anybody can own a part of this team. So this is something you found online? It is. Okay. So anybody for a very small price, you know, to, can buy a voting right share, share okay. in a professional sports team. I own shares in a professional sports team, well, apparently. Right now it's semi-pro. This fall it's going to be pro with the Founders Cup. They have a women's team. They have a oh, youth foundation. Oh, they have the semi-pro team, We're, guys, and guess what? They're playing a high-powered Guatemalan national team tonight. So is that what we're doing? Yeah, we're going to the we're going, Are we going to see football or soccer? Insert, Sonia, this is Sonia from the future, letting you know that yes, Matt is referring to traditional soccer. Number two, you will come to enjoy this game, and number three, by the end of this vlog, you will want to move to Chattanooga. Listen, you guys know I moved here from Canada to the U.S. And uh, one of the reasons I moved was because I knew that I would get to see a whole New other part of the world. Things. Yeah, so you guys get to come along with me uh, today as we do some now you have exciting some, things now together. Now you and Mark Cuban have something in uh, common. What's that? Your sports team owners. You're right. <laughs> this is seven better. <laughs> Who else loves Shark Tank? All right, I'll show you the view from the window. And uh, we're going to get ready to head out, right? Yeah. All right, Matt's got all the plans. He's hooking us all up. I'm just along for the ride, just like you guys. Then keep right to merge onto US 27 North. So it's a little bit later. We went out, we went to the merch store, and I hooked myself up with a really nice Chattanooga sweatshirt love it earlier we headed out to whole foods we had a great supper we just sat outside it was so nice the trees are in blossom here oh my gosh it's beautiful also found out that the um the fans the supporters of the chattanooga football club call themselves chattahooligans hopefully i said that right chattahooligans and so i think they're tailgating outside getting ready for the game to start Guys, Matt couldn't have picked a better day because, let me just tell you, it is gorgeous. Oh, yeah. gotta, yeah, we gotta make sure. Okay. Guys, I found a friend! Nick! How are you? I'm great. Nice to meet you. Know. Everybody's wearing scarves. Yeah. Scarf. So, okay, so I am new here. Just walked upon this big crowd. What is happening right now? 
So this is the tailgate, and okay. uh, we do this before every game. It's an all-are-welcome tailgate, so uh, we always try to make the food um, specific to the team that we're playing. So we've got some Guatemalan-inspired oh, wow. uh, dishes over there. Are you a regular here? Absolutely. Are you from here? Absolutely. So, like, you you just come, you hang out with your friends, you hang out before the game, and yeah, you guys this is this is a eats. family. Really? It is. Okay, so what am I what am I about to experience tonight? Not going inside. Like what am I gonna see? Am I gonna feel it? What am I gonna feel? If you're close enough to the drums, you'll feel it. Okay. Um, you'll hear us, definitely. Okay. Uh, we're gonna march in uh, about ten minutes before the game starts. Okay. And chant and sing for the entire time. No way. So Absolutely. this is gonna be quite the event. Oh yeah, it's gonna be great. This is more than just a soccer game. Yeah, you're in for a treat. Okay, alright. Alright, well you go, you go to get ready. All and right. uh, we're gonna go in, inside and get ready. Guys, I found somebody to give us the lowdown on what I'm about to experience. So tell me, young man, tell me who you are and why are you here tonight? Uh, my name is Marshall Brock. I'm one of the founders of Chattanooga Football Club. So we've been doing this since 2009. This is, I believe, our 11th season. Don't hold me to that, 10th or 11th season. And we're here tonight to play Comunicaciones, which is sort of the New York Yankees of Guatemala. And of course, they play soccer and not baseball. So Chattanooga Football Club versus Comunicaciones. Man, it sounds like it's going to be a nail biter. Who's going to win? I hope it's a nail biter. I'm going to go ahead and say that they should be way better than we are because they're the best team in Guatemala and have been for several years. So we are a lower division team in the United States of America, but we're going to do our best to uh, hold our own. And I understand this is your first ever soccer game? Yeah, so what should I expect once I go inside those gates here? Everybody's piling in. I'm about to be the next person. What's about to go down here? It's awesome. We have an incredible atmosphere. We have a great fan base. At some point, there will be a constant hum of drums and chanting and cheering from the stands. When you're at a live soccer game and you get to see up close and personal how fast it is and how strong and big the athletes are, it impresses anyone, even if you don't understand soccer. So you're in for a great time. You'll get well-priced food and beer that hopefully is of high quality, and you're gonna have one of the best times of your life, which means the rest of your soccer life is gonna be a little bit downhill from here. So <laughs> I hate that you're starting at the top, but I'm glad you're here. So for anybody out there watching, for lots of people are going to be watching out there, um, what makes your team so special and why should they come visit too? Well, I was reminded today at a lunch, so this is unusual, but because we're playing a team from Guatemala, we had the Guatemalan ambassador to the United States is, is here at our game and had lunch with us. And I was reminded that this is always about so much more than a soccer game and a competition on a field, which is of course why we're all here but it's about tons, thousands of little stories that are happening. Tonight, the story is that we're getting to, as Chattanooga, host our own Guatemalan community, as well as Guatemalans from elsewhere, who are coming here to see one of their favorite things, which is one of their hometown teams play. So as always, there's a thousand stories that are happening at every one of these games, and that's what's really happening here tonight, is all these people, all these families, all these fans, big, small, fat, skinny, rich, poor, coming together to be in one place and share something. And tell me, beautiful. last question for you. How did you get into this sport? What makes you love it? Yeah, I love soccer because of its fluidity. It's creative. There's not plays and one way to play it. It all happens right there. There are things that you can do as a general rule, but in general, it all happens different every game. I played a lot in my life. I've watched my kids flourish in it. I think it teaches great lessons, and I'm very thankful that we get to have a soccer team here in Chattanooga. Woohoo! And I am so thrilled to be here. Thank I'm you. I'm so, so glad much. you guys are here. Thank you for coming, Matt and <laughs> oh, Sonia. Thank you for the hospitality. You guys are awesome. We're Welcome excited. from Pittsburgh. Thank you. All right, let's head inside, guys. When, when is the, the, the fair and the Guatemala all kids have this look? <laughs> Yeah. 
munchies. What do you think? Oh, Chick-fil-A waffle chips. Never had these before. Yeah, we've got good sponsorships. Thank so, you. So, uh, what do you think? You did good. Was your husband this right? fun. I even found myself screaming. I know. She, she was jumping out of her seat earlier. Yeah. Right. Good times. Okay, an update. Let's see, we're 61 minutes into the game, and I've learned that soccer games go for 90 minutes. Right, extra and, time. And our team is holding off the other team. Like 30 time national Guatemalan champion. Super popular team. Yep. Six, six years If most people there. were betting, they probably bet on the other team, oh, but yeah. our team, our team, is holding them off. And right oh, now, oh, all of a sudden it's our team. It's now. our team. See? Dude, it's our team. Look at the scoreboard over here. You can see right now there is exactly. We're almost at 90 minutes, right? So we got another half an hour left. Let's we'll see if anybody scored. guys you saw the timer as it was running out well we are back at the hotel and I have to tell you that our guys lost our guys put up a fight though I mean they oh. they went to so hard to the very end I mean they were giving it all she got you know what I'm saying <laughs> what, what, what our our guys our guys our yes do you, dude you mean as in the we are team? now part owners of a soccer team Wait, was this the, a darn good soccer wait, team? Wait, wait, was this the, the guys point? tried to bring it home for me tonight? Wait, what? was this disbelieving Sonia? Was this <laughs> Sonia's like, I don't want anything to do with this on the way to the stadium? Listen, I know, I know all the, the what's it called? Chatta, 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 chatta hooligans. Chatta, chatta hooligans? Yeah. Chatta, I know all the chatta hooligan chants. Listen, I'm there. I'm there. <laughs> Count me in. I know all the lyrics now. I'm ready to go. Uh oh. Listen, uh -oh. our guys put up a good fight. Okay, so here they did. They played. They, they played an amazing game and they lost it in the last ten minutes. They but, did. They were so but, close. And yeah. here's the thing. Okay, so here's what I learned. Here's what I learned. All right. Okay. I learned that the team that they were up against were a super popular, very very successful, really good team in Guatemala. Time, yeah, thirty times. Thirty Guatemala. time champion, yeah. champions, and like when they came out, the Guatemalan that community shit. came out um, to in you know they were supporting that side of the uh, players tonight, that team. And they came out tonight, and when the players came out on the field, it was like, like you said it, Matt, right? They were yeah. like, they were like superstars. superstars, like they were like movie stars, and they came out, and um, yeah, so they, so our guys were up against them. Oh wait, wait, wait! And Say that again. Say that again. Uh, anyway, in the last ten minutes, it was so, oh man, we but moved they, spots. Played, I think we caused some but, bad luck. But I'll tell you what. What? They were they were like they did not want to get embarrassed, so they were like substituting all of our players. Yeah. Our best player only came in with five minutes left. Yeah, yeah. Just to warm up. Yeah. So anyway, so there's always next time. It's pretty cool. Wait, it's wait, pretty wait, cool. Wait, 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 Chattanooga wait. is wait. amazing. Are Are you saying next time, as in you? you I'm would, I'm coming back. You would come back for a game. I gotta support my team. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously, they need me. All right, we're coming back again. All right, I want to know who's watching the vlog from Tennessee because we got some darn good players. <laughs> wow. This was an awesome day. I've got to say, get out there, try something new. Thank you, Matt, for introducing me to something new. I never, never ever sat through a wait, soccer wait, wait, game wait, wait, wait. before. What did, you, what did you just say? I said thank you. Oh, really? Yes. Because you didn't even want to go to the game early. Well, I was like, I don't even know. Like, yeah. I just didn't know if it was my thing. It, but I got there, and it was amazing team spirit and community. Were, it was this is fun. Funny. It was awesome. By the end of the third minute, she was jumping up yes. to see what was happening. So. Woohoo! All right, and so concludes another Junk Monkey Road Trip. Where will we be tomorrow? It's going to be another great day because we're hitting the road. I'll see you guys again tomorrow. Thank you if you have subscribed to my channel. Thank you, thank you, thank you.
you. And if you are new here, be sure to hit subscribe because there's lots more of these kinds of adventures coming up. Leave me a comment below. Did you have fun watching tonight's vlog? Do you ever watch soccer? And have you ever been to Chattanooga? It's a pretty cool place. I will see you tomorrow. Bye, see ya. Bye. Bye. <laughs>